What is up, everybody? My name is Frankie, and today we are doing something a little bit more familiar if you uh, have been watching my channel since before I started doing these daily December type videos. And today we are going to be finishing off my Billie Eilish song tearless video for the second time <laughs> since I last did an installment to the series she has released a new song which most of you probably are aware of which is therefore I am and for the better part of a month month and a half I have been doing my best to try and not listen to the song until I was able to sit down and do something like this and the only little bits that I heard of it were the parts that were used in the TikTok trend a little while ago. So I'm pretty new to the song in general. So I am very ready to give my first impressions as to how I feel about the song and my rankings for it. And yes, I do have the tier list already ready with the little icon and stuff right here. So this time I am going to actually watch the music video instead of just listening to it on Spotify like I did last time. My mistake on that part. I did eventually watch the music video in that video, but yeah, I'm just gonna jump into this music video and I will see you guys in just a second. Stop. What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> I noticed that around like uh, a minute 50 and three minutes 50, there was like a big pause in the video and I'm not sure if that's also part of the actual song so the music video is definitely longer than the actual song at least how it is on spotify and the two breaks are probably just so they can fit more things in the music video which is fine i don't have any problem with that i'd have to listen to it one more time just on its own here in spotify so give me a second to do that stop what the hell are you talking about? So after a second first actual listen through of the entire song, I definitely do enjoy this one quite a bit. It is definitely a return to form compared to things like um, No Time to Die and I guess to a lesser extent My Future, at least in my opinion. Something else that I enjoyed about this song is that we got some of Phineas's vocals as like background stuff. That was really nice to hear once again. Always nice to have some proper like bass tones and notes in any sort of song, especially when it's primarily being led by a female singer. So that was really nice to hear. I really did enjoy how there was like that rhythmic sort of like talking thing around like one minute 30 seconds to one minute 40 seconds that's also something that i really enjoyed and i would say that this song also feels a lot like bellyache and like this song really felt in line with the don't smile at me ep quite a bit throughout it and that's something that i would say generally <laughs> makes me enjoy the songs more most of the b tier is songs from the don't smile at me ep and quite a few songs from that i guess like era are occupying the S and A tier and specifically like I mentioned before bellyache so with that all being said I really can't give this anything lower than a B tier at this point but at the same time I feel like this song is more or less a natural evolution to bellyache in a way so then it would probably land itself around A tier as well so with all of that put together, I would probably have to say that in my opinion, I would have to put this in the A tier along with all of these other songs, along with my future as well. And that was basically for all the reasons that I mentioned. I did write stuff down. I did take notes while I was uh, listening to both the YouTube uh, music video and the actual full Spotify release of the song. And one thing that I commented on during the actual music video is that we really got to see some of the YouTube compression at work in the video. It was definitely an interesting music video and definitely a really, really good song overall, I would say. I definitely want to like go back through this entire tier list at some point, taking out pretty much all of the remixes, except for the Anne Byrne remix that I definitely will keep in there because that song is incredible 
in its own right, but I would like to go through this whole thing again without all of, I guess, the fluff that was pretty much all of the remixes from Ocean Eyes and Six Feet Under, because that, oh boy, that definitely took up a lot of space on this tier list when I was originally making it. But yeah, at the end of the day, I give Therefore I Am a solid A tier on this tier list, and as of right now, this tier list is complete. So if you have any opinions that are different to mine, please tell me in the comment section below, especially regarding some of the more recent additions to this tier list, like Therefore I Am and My Future. Those definitely are some songs I'm going to have to go through a bit more to like properly form my opinions on them, and especially a lot of the other songs, because there's definitely a lot of these songs that I haven't listened to in quite a while but yeah eventually i will update this tier list but as of right now this is where it stands with that being said i'd like to thank each and every one of you for watching this video and if you're new around here please consider hitting that subscribe button and two more days of daily december wow this month has definitely gone by very quick in my opinion but yeah with that all being said i hope you guys have a great rest of your day and i'll catch you guys in the next video peace Oh, I really hope that recorded the right screen. Okay, it did.